Hello my scrumptious ravens and welcome to day 110. I hope it's 110. Um, it is almost 1am guys and I'm heading to bed. Um, I just wasn't feeling tired and you know I, gotta, I had to play some league and some Valorant. So I'm going to bed now and it didn't help that I had coffee so late at night. I think I had it around like 7 or 8pm. So I'm not really tired yet, but I'm going to try to force myself to go to sleep. I just wanted to do a quick recap of what happened today. So I ended up drinking four bottles of water. Um, I did end up doing my push-ups, my uh, knee push-ups with the resistance bands. I hit 19, so boom shakalaka boom. Um, I ate a whole bunch of bad food, guys. Bad, bad food. I did do my Quran study. Um, I ate some cake. I had some coffee, like I said. Half cup of coffee. Oh, sorry, not a full cup. A full, full cup of coffee. Half cup of normal milk and cereal. Yes, I said normal milk. I was trying to go poop. And some mozzarella sticks, some samosas, some biryani, some gulab jamun, some cauliflower... Um, un ca cauliflower rings, like kind of like onion rings, but they're made out of cauliflower. So it was a feast. Today was my brother's birthday. So we all spent time together as a family and just ate a whole bunch of food. But hopefully starting tomorrow onward. Oh, and a bowl of yogurt as well. Um, I need to incorporate more liquidy stuff in my diet because I think eating all of this dry foods and just always having dry stuff in my diet along with not drinking enough water has really led to like some digestive problems and if I need to fix them I need to fix my diet so starting tomorrow I'm gonna try to incorporate more liquidy stuff in my diet like more yogurts even my sandwiches I'll try to make them more like soggy I guess I need to up my water intake and I need to be like chugging that water I need to get things, start eating things with more fiber in it. So hopefully I can start making more of those changes in my diet. It also doesn't help that I am severely stressed out. This work, this job um, stresses me out like, like no other. Um, so it really affects like what I eat, how much I eat, when I eat, how much I drink and when I drink. Uh, and I got to fix that. I got to fix that. It, it's really going to affect my health. Like I'm starting to feel pain in my kidney. I'm starting to feel pain like in certain parts of my body that I should not be feeling. It's not good. It's not a, a good sign. I get chest aches and, uh, I'm just, yo, sometimes I feel like I'm going to get a heart attack and I'm really, really worried about that. And you all know that you don't have to be old super old to get a heart attack so it really could happen to anyone at any time so i'm trying to keep my stress under control i'm trying to have good days i'm trying to focus on myself emotionally like today i did have a moment of stress like severe stress when i started thinking about going back to work tomorrow and things i needed to get done and i opened up my email today and there was like 87 emails waiting for me and i was like this is ridiculous i take two days off and I, there's 87 emails waiting for me. And now, and that was midway through the day that I checked. And now it's probably up to 100. So it's coming back to the, and guess what? Some of them were like urgent stuff that needs to be done by 12 o'clock tomorrow morning. So it's just like, like my chest is hurting just thinking about it. Like it's aching. And I really don't think that that's good for my health. Uh, so... Hopefully I can get out of here soon. It's this place legit gives me stress and anxiety and totally kills my vibe, kills my mood, kills my brightness. And I really hope that I can get something else soon. So that is the recap for the day. And as always, I am wishing your heart and your mind and your soul and your spirit and your day peace and happiness please choose to be kind to yourself and to others stay safe stay scrumptious and god willing i will see you all tomorrow take care and raven out good night